Hi, hi friend. I got to show you how to create an expenditure and income sheet on Microsoft Azure and chat bar. Okay, what I simply means by expenditure? Expenditure simply means the money you spend after business. The income simply means the money you achieve, the money you gain out of the business. So I will show you how to use a particular software, application software called Microsoft Excel to calculate it. And this tutorial is simply specific for those who are under accountancy or banking and finance or anything calculation in their area and as you can see right now I have my own laptop that means you can also use your Android phone to calculate on Microsoft Azure if you have Microsoft Word apps on your main Android phone so let me really show you how you can calculate your expenditure and your income on Microsoft SA. Okay, let's start. This is my Microsoft SA. This is my Microsoft SA. And as you can see, this is my Microsoft SA. And I know that people who are watching this video are people who are into computer before because you have a you need to have a basic knowledge on this Microsoft Excel so that you can carry out this operation I got to show you okay now this is my Microsoft Excel and this is the sheet and this is my cell and this is my menu bars and uh, we also have the rows which is the numbers then we have the alphabet which is the columns and in Microsoft Excel we simply use columns and rows to calculate on it okay how does this work it really work by arithmetic columns and rows to calculate on Microsoft Excel so let me show you how this work now I want to draw my monthly my monthly sheet I want to draw my monthly sheet and as you can see month my monthly sheet I have items amount that is the month the items and the amount the total amount no expenditure expend let's use as ESB expenditure just to save our time expenditure We have the total done as you can see right now the month January the items or quantity you can also put items simply means the goods I have books and the amount of the books is 400 and I make expenditure of 150 and now what is my total how can I calculate it on Microsoft as now as you can see right now we are now in the specific area I want you to build to come 
for your attention on this specific area because this is where we got to get out to calculate our expenditure and the amount so what you got to do right now is just the formula of is equal to sum brackets open c three that is where the amount is minus d three brackets close and enter key as as you can see our total amount here is 250 250 we bought the book 400 we sold the book 400 and we make an expenditure of 150 and the total amount here is 250 in january so now i will show you how to insert a chart on it understanding the chart and how to insert it a chart simply means a symbol that make it attractive easy to understand a worksheet so let me highlight only the amount and the expenditure then when you want to insert the chart you got to highlight the things you want to insert the chart on which is the amount of the expenditure I want to use and the total the amount of the expenditure and the total that's what I want to use for the chart so after highlighting after a light I got to click on insert I go to column we have different kind of chart we have column chart we have line chart we have pen we have bar we have area but I love using column chart okay I click on cylinder cylinder chart and as you can see here now we have 400 which is the amount is the 400 horizontal categories is higher than the expenditure is 150 which is lower and the total income the total which is 250 is here so with your own understanding and your sight you don't really need to be confused how you can get your expenditure and your total with a chart if anyone you don't really know about what you calculate on this sheet self see something like this chart on your on your sheet you already understand that this total simply means it's high and this expenditure simply means it's low and this total uh, this amount simply means it's high so that is everything about your expenditure and your income so thank you for watching this video and subscribe more bye for now